Now we come to her other end. What we're gonna be doing is we're gonna work on her tail because it's awfully fluffy and clean up this so she doesn't get any issues when she goes potty. This is where I like to use this stuff. Um, it is basically a chalk that you're gonna put on the coat. Sometimes it's a little difficult to get out of. There we go. Let's put it on like that because this is a sensitive area and we want as much grip as we can get when we're pulling. So what we're going to do, just like with the rest of the dog, you can use this and just pull the long hairs. You don't want a naked tail, but you want a nice shaped tail. And this is important. This is when it's important to pull with the hair. So you're going to start, just pull up all the long stuff little at a time and you're pulling okay you're gonna do the same thing back here okay and just a little at a time and you're gonna pull it and no they're not gonna like it and they're gonna fuss but it's got to be done for them hygienically keep everybody clean but once again a little at a time okay Tip of the tail can be a little bit tricky. So once again, this is when I like to use my knife and just pull a little at a time with the direction of the hair, little by little. You want the back of the tail nice and short. So any of this, anything long, you're gonna take off. And then you got a nice shaped tail cute little Norwich butt. Next we're going to do this area. And we want it nice and short so that we do not have any issues when we go potty. Now, if you're really uncomfortable with pulling this hair, you can scissor it. But once you scissor it, you're going to have to always scissor it because you're going to ruin a nice harsh coat if you don't pull it. And all we want is something that simple, okay? That way she doesn't poop on herself. And if this area bugs you out, then wear a pair of gloves when you do this. Nothing wrong with that. But now, when she goes potty, she's clean.